Hey, good morning there, Porcupines. It's about 20 after 9. This is Big Mike calling. I just wanted to let everybody know that uh, Joe Skinner and his fiance Jen and Neil Connor and I just were at the, uh, what is that, what county are we at? Uh, Merrimack County. The Merrimack County Courthouse in Concord trying to do Fiji outreach. And we got a little bit of a late start, but uh, toward the end, uh, the sheriff's deputies came outside and gave us a bunch of shit, said that we weren't allowed to be there and that we had to get permission. And I, was, I told him I wasn't really seeking permission, but I went inside to go meet with the clerk of the court who was busy and just couldn't talk with me. And they said that next time we can't come there, uh, if uh, if we do come back without getting permission, that they're going to go ahead and arrest us. So I, don't, I told him that I would probably call the clerk of the court and just let him know that we're going to be out there, but I don't even think I'm going to do that. So we're going to find out the next time that it happens. And uh, hopefully we can get a bunch of people out to Concord because they're planning to make arrests if we don't have permission to be there. So it should be kind of an interesting day. Um, I'm looking forward to seeing everybody out at the uh, 420 at 420 event at uh, Veterans Park today in downtown Manchester. And uh, you guys take care. Have a good day. Bye-bye. So on to Fiji. Yeah. What happened today, this morning? When? The crazy bureaucrats, man. All right. So we get out there. Uh, we were a little bit late. Uh, showing up, we got lost or went to the wrong address or something. And uh, once we got there, hold on, sir. Okay, so we get out there and we showed up at like 10 minutes to nine or five to nine. Most of the jurors were already inside. And, uh, a sheriff's deputy came outside and asked to see one of the flyers in his demanding little bureaucratic way. We went back inside and they came back out like four of them about 10 minutes later and uh, you know said we couldn't be there and what are we doing? You guys got to get permission to do this, and I told them, you know, you don't have to get permission. This is a first, uh, you know, First Amendment issue, freedom of speech, and uh, the courts have always ruled in, uh, in in favor of people. I think that have done FIJA outreach before. So, um, I they took me inside and they wanted me to uh, speak to the actual clerk and. I waited around. He wasn't coming down, or they couldn't find him, or something. And on the way out, you, you know, you really can't get anybody to talk to you, can you? I, you know, I thought I was cute, but uh, we'll see. Uh, did you I think. Ask, did you ask him for an RSA or anything? No, you know, to no, no. Yeah. The I, 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 I told him that we're not going to ask for permission. We're just going to come back the next time. And you know, I, I've, you know, I called Paulette over here at this courthouse and uh, established a little bit of a relationship with her. I didn't do it so professionally in Nashua. She asked, we, Joe and I just kind of did a drive-by FIJA outreach uh, last Monday. We just went and decided spur of the moment the night before, hey, you want to go do it? Yeah, sure, no pork 411, just the two of us. And um, I went inside as a courtesy to, you know, to hand a copy of the pamphlet to the jury clerk. And she said, well, I'm going to have to get, you know, this authorized by my boss. And I said, we're just going to do it anyway. And she said, you're just going to do it anyway? Yeah, so we did it, but we didn't get it. Well, we, I mean, we didn't encounter any resistance there. It was cool, but these guys, I don't know, man. I have to see what happens. I'd like to show up at that one for like 50 people, so I'm gonna well, call. It's Concord. It's where the big bureaucrats are. Is it? Well, hey, well, I guess they haven't learned to deal with the free staters, no. so. The legislature in general, right? So when do you know when the next uh, Concord? Uh, well, I'm, I'm actually going to have to call there uh, to find out for sure. We think it's every two weeks, but um, one of the guys that helped organize it said that uh, uh, it's uh, and sometimes it can be on a Tuesday. Like once a month, it might be on a Tuesday instead of a Monday. So maybe they post it, or we got to call every time. But I'm going to call. I'll get a definitive date. And, you know, I'll post some information about it. And hopefully, we'll have a bunch of people show up. That should be pretty fun. They said they'll take us down in the basement. I guess that's where the dungeon is, so.